What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the mic zone. Today we're going to be looking at the behind the scenes. This isn't as exciting as the five right there that are below it that you can see. But I mean, hey, it's cool to see behind the scenes stuff. So let's just watch it. Black Ops 4 is really a celebration of our community and something we've wanted to do for a really long time is focus on PC as its own unique platform and give PC gamers what they deserve. This version of the game is custom built for the PC and I think that's going to show through in every part of it. Was that the KN I saw? Rob, I think I just saw the KN. With Phoenix, in addition to Blizzard who have been... Blizzard's on... And bringing the game to the Blizzard's with Black Ops 4? That's wow, that's for cool. The franchise. Yeah, because they got Overwatch. Those of us at Blizzard right, have been uh, friends with Travis Wait, for yeah, that's the guy that made Overwatch. Overwatch. That's the guy with, like, the because Overwatch memes. Kind of How do I not know who that features. is? It's the first first-person shooter Blizzard has ever made, so hearing their advice really helped us First First-person shooter? Yeah, what are you talking really about? We can Overwatch. welcome them onto the Battle.net platform yeah, because they Call of Duty is a cultural landmark. This is why they said it was gonna be like Overwatch. Everybody was saying it's gonna be like Overwatch, because Overwatch is with them now. It is going to be fully integrated with all these social features on Battle.net. You'll be able to add friends, talk with your friends, see them play in other games, party up, and interact with them in game. We're gonna be able to talk to players across Black Ops 4, into Overwatch, which should be pretty amazing. Oh my god. It's like, um, it's a CUDA. PC players expect a lot of options. They like to customize their gameplay experience exactly how they want it. At Binox, we have a long history of PC development. And so the PC community is always in the back of our minds. We're really talking about making sure that we've delivered on what they wanted. For the Black Ops games, we've always had dedicated servers, and this game is no exception. They provide. Where's Blundell? The Where's the sucker for medieval castles? PC players need. We are testing on the widest assortment of hardware possible to make sure the largest number of people can play and enjoy Black Ops 4. We really wanted to tighten up the gunplay mechanics and make the movement system feel as smooth and as responsive as it possibly can. There also has been a whole redesign of the UI flow, and we have made tweaks to how weapons react. Things like recoil, weapon knockback, so that for a keyboard and mouse player, it's easy to get back on target. It would be nice cross-play, that'd be really good. Support 4K, HDR, ultra-wide monitors. It's going to have great scalability options, so everybody will be able to optimize for visual fidelity. Actually, this is actually a really good video. It's not something I'd be jumping up and down for, it, but it's like respectful. by this idea of bringing the game to PC in a much bigger way than we've ever done before. Did I not see that? PC game available October 12th! Oh wait, that's a normal release date. Alright, well. Oh, okay. Well, I guess you're gonna see a PewDiePie video then. So, yeah. Hopefully, you all enjoyed. I mean, that video isn't that much of a, what's it called? I guess, um, jumping up and down cool reaction video, but it's nice to see what's it called. All that stuff. Oh, speaking of the Smith plays, who's at the event, but I'm not. No, I'm joking. He's good. Pat's real good. Hopefully, I could be as good as him one day, meet him, Lex, and all of them. And that's PewDiePie. It's just PewDiePie. I mean, you can't say anything. That's the bandwagon things. And, well, yeah. Instead of that, actually, we're just going to say the outro then, I guess. Instead of talking about these things. So I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram with the mics on official IG. And hopefully we could share some Black Ops 4 moments together. Goodbye. I've been saying that a lot because I really feel like that, that could be my new outro. Because I want to share a lot of Black Ops 4 moments with everybody. So yeah. Goodbye and I hope we could share some together.